Hello friends, hi, this is Ganesh Naik. Today we are going to be diving into the world of alternative investments and exploring the Chartered Alternative Investment Analyst designation, which is commonly known as CAIA. If you are interested in diversifying your knowledge in the financial world, stay tuned as we break down the key concepts of the CAIA course. What is the CAIA designation all about? The Chartered Alternative Investment Analyst program is a prestigious professional credential, which is granted by the Chartered Alternative Investment Analyst association. It is a globally recognized certification that showcases expertise in analyzing non-traditional assets such as venture capital, private equity, derivatives and more. CAIA charter holders are well equipped to assess and manage various alternative investment making them highly demanded for roles related to alternative investments, portfolio management and trading desk. To achieve this designation, candidate must successfully complete both level 1 and level 2 exam. Let us go into the details of this CAIA course. The program consists of two levels of exam, each lasting four hours. Level 1 consists of 200 multiple choice questions, while level 2 consists of 100 multiple choice questions and three sets of constructed response questions also. The curriculum covers a range of topics including professional standards, ethics, introduction to alternative investments, real assets, hedge funds and private equity. Candidates are generally recommended to dedicate over 200 hours of study to prepare for this exam and this exam is conducted twice a year in the month of March and in the month of September, giving candidate a good amount of flexibility in choosing the exam month. Now let us look into the CAIA course pass rate over the years. As of September 2023, the level 1 pass percentage was 48% while level 2 pass percentage was 65%. Since 2011, the level 1 pass rate has seen a downward trend remaining below 70% while the level 2 pass rate has ranged from 56 to 70%. Despite these challenges, the average pass rate for both the levels of CAI exam is around 61 to 63% respectively. It is essential to understand that historical pass percentages are just an idea to give you an update that what is the difficulty of the exam. CAI exam topics. Moving on to the topics which are covered in the actual CAI exam. In level 1, the focus is on the introduction to alternative investments covering areas like professional standards, ethic, real assets, private securities, hedge fund and structured product. Let us now go into into the details of the weightages for the level 1 exam. So over here we see that professional standards and I think covers around 15 to 25 percent. Introduction to alternative investment covers 20 to 28 percent. Real assets covers around 11 to 17 percent. Private securities covers around 12 to 20 percent. Hedge funds cover around 11 to 17 percent and structured product covers around 10 to 14 percent. When we go to level 2, so on the screen you can see the level 2 topics bifurcation in terms of multiple choice and in terms of constructed response. Now let us go into the financial aspect of the designation. What exactly is the fees for the CI exam? Now the exam fees is quite straightforward. Let us go into the details properly. The first one, enrollment fees, $400. Exam registration fee for both level 1 and level 2. The early bird registration is $995 and standard registration is $1,395. Exam registration retakes is around $795. What are the different job roles that are available to you if you complete this certification? Then you can become a portfolio manager, consultant, you can also become a risk manager, fund administrator, investment analyst, investment consultant, investment advisor, investment manager and also you can enter into an investment officer role. What is the demand for alternative investment? Now the demand for alternative investment is growing rapidly. The CAI designation becomes increasingly valuable. According to BlackRock, the institutional clients are currently allocating around 25% of their portfolio to alternatives and this is expected to grow to around 30 to 40% in the near future. For ordinary investors, the allocation is projected to rise from 3% to 25%. So if you are considering a career into the alternative investment area, obtaining the CAIA designation could be a strategic move to meet the growing demand in the industry. So at an overall level, the Chartered Alternative Investment Analyst designation is a globally recognized credential that opens up the door to diverse career opportunities in the alternative investment space. If you are intrigued by the world of non-traditional assets and want to enhance your expertise, the CAIA course might be a very good perfect match for you. If you find this video informative and helpful, don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more insights into the finance and investment world and thank you for joining us for today and we'll see you for next video on the Fintelligent channel.